From the liver, phospholipids are transported to the brain where neurons can absorb them in three ways. Passive diffusion, active diffusion facilitated by MFSD2A receptors, or passive absorption of micelles. Passive diffusion is where the omega-3 simply moves through the cell membrane. But passive diffusion works on a concentration gradient, going from a high concentration to a low concentration. The problem with fish oil is that the brain already has a high concentration of omega-3 fatty acids. Even in individuals with existing deficiencies, the concentration of EPA and DHA phospholipids will be higher in the brain than in the blood. This is why people are recommended to take high doses of omega-3s. The high doses of fish oil are essentially saturating the blood, trying to force the omegas into the brain. Active transport utilizes the brain's natural mechanism for omega-3 uptake and accretion by using the MFSD2A receptor. This receptor is the most effective way of delivering EPA and DHA to the neuronal cell membrane. MFSD2A is highly concentrated on the blood-brain barrier and selectively binds and transports phospholipids containing omega-3 fatty acids into the neuron. Because the MFSD2A receptor specifically recognizes and transports omega-3s in the phospholipid form, high doses are not required. In fact, studies suggest that the brain is only able to absorb about one milligram of omega-3 fatty acids per kilogram of the individual per day. Phospholipids can also form liquid droplets called micelles that may naturally fuse with a neuron's membrane. However, micelle absorption only accounts for 5 to 10 percent of all omega-3 uptake by our neurons. Accentrate's tissue-targeted EPA and DHA are formulated specifically to leverage the innate active transport pathway and micelle absorption.